Welcome to Hot Button Hashtags. My name is Matt. In an effort to carry on making one thing, at least one thing every day for the year of 2017, uh, this is my thing. It's pretty late in the day. Uh, I thought I was going to be making another thing earlier. That fell through, and so I spent the whole day prior not doing things, like making things like I should have been. So uh, I put all that off, and now... <clears throat> And now this is what I'm making, a video of me resting my head on my hand. This goes on for like 20 minutes, guys. That's not true. But I have, I have a question. I have uh, a little bit of advice that I want to uh, get. That's really weird. <laughs> Sorry, I, I haven't even been drinking. I don't even have that excuse. So I have this friend. Uh, he's a really nice guy. He's very intelligent. Uh, but he has this really obnoxious habit. Whenever he doesn't know about something or understand something or like something, he just becomes extremely cynical and, and verbally abusive. He just has this tiny nugget of insecurity that sort of takes over his face and makes him say things that are mean. I'm not worried that he's going to watch this video and then be like, hey, why'd you make a video about me? Because... He doesn't watch my videos. In fact, he makes fun of me for having a YouTube channel. So whatever. How do I? How do I? How do I deal with that kind of personality? Not that person in general, but with that personality. How does how does one deal with that kind of harsh personality? You know, they 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 almost think it's laughable that you try new things or want to do anything new or different. What do you do with that? Do you internalize it and say, man, you know, uh, maybe maybe I'm not the person to try this thing? Or do you say, maybe that's not a thing to be tried? Or do you say, that person has a huge stick up his butt. I should yank it out and then beat him with it. I'm not entirely sure any of those are the correct, the correct solution. When I do this, I look like someone is watching me through a crystal ball and they're warning someone else. There's a hooded stranger with a beard and a fat mouth coming for you. One thing is for certain, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let this criticism keep me from trying new things and learning new, new skills and uh, exploring, just exploring the world and and finding out what I'm good at and what I enjoy. I'm 39 years old. That is information I should have already acquired, but I never did. Uh, because my whole life, people have been telling me that uh, I shouldn't be doing what I'm doing. Usually that involved, you know, like, oh, there's a law against it or whatever. But um, oftentimes it was, you're not good enough at that. Or, y you know, who do you think you are? That's not something that a person like you should be attempting. I, I a lot of times, avoided things that I wanted to try on the advice of people who didn't really have my best interests at mind or at heart at whatever at whatever body part interest should be attached to magnifying magnifying glasses are fun um that has nothing to do with what i'm talking about or maybe it does maybe the magnifying glass is what i should be using to to really look deep down inside to find the oh i just i just broke wind that was that was ridiculous and this video is over. Thanks for watching.